Misty Divine UK Emily Thomas here. Um, today I thought that I would make you a very special video where I'll be talking about my insecurities and things that I don't really feel comfortable with. If I talk to you guys about them, it'll make me feel better about them and also if you guys have things in common, it'll make you guys feel better about them. So don't be afraid to leave a comment down below if you want to share any of your insecurities too i hope you enjoy i hope you f it makes you guys feel better yeah i just came from the gym so you're gonna have to excuse me if my hair's like a little bit wild like a little bit you know not perfect because nobody's perfect okay let me just get into the video this is really hard for me to tell you guys because i never talk about this if you're always wondering why i'm facing this way not this way it's because of my side face like it's really strange right but i suffer with overactive thyroid where like my glands swell sometimes my face looks as if i just said botox but um what it is is when they inflame this side of my face sometimes it's this side not really that much but this side of my face like <laughs> see can you see the difference it's not symmetrical you just can't get rid of it this is kind of ca common in some people and some people don't know that they have it i think because i know i have it i don't like it it's been my insecurity since i was about since i can remember like i remember when i was younger i'd always have like a fringe like a swoopy fringe like it's because i wanted to hide it that's the reason why i'm wearing my hair like this on this video because i wanted to show you guys it yeah, I hate wearing my hair up in the bubble. I'll never wear my hair up in the bubble. I always wear my hair down because I try to hide it. When I tell people that, a lot of people say, Oh my god, I want that. It's like so unique. I'm like, yeah, but it's, it's not. I don't like it. Um, so that's my first ever insecurity. I'm insecure about my teeth. Um, see, the reason why I'm insecure about my teeth. What happened is, we all have that magical first kiss. But my first kiss was not magical because he chipped my tongue. See, and it goes up in a... Someone keeps ringing me, I'm so sorry. Why are you ringing me? Mm. Hold on, I forgot my password. Right, this is my sister's phone actually. I, I'm using her for, oops. I to ask the dentist, dentist. Um, I got a chip and I can't get rid of it. What should I do? And he said to me, he said, look, you can't get rid of it because the chip is too small. You can't, it's not big enough to patch up. It's just something you gotta live with. It's not causing you any trouble or damage, so. There's no point worrying about it. But I'm not going to moan about it too much. Because so, I should be thankful that my teeth are healthy. That's just what I think. So. And my twin sister. She got braces. So her teeth are literally like perfect. It's like one thing that we, we didn't have in common. So my third insecurity is. Huh, this is funny actually. Because I've actually changed my voice. If you go back on my old YouTube videos. You'll be able to see how much my voice have changed from my accent. Because I've started speaking a bit more clearly now. Like I used to like suffer with anxiety. So I'd always say like. Exactly I'm doing it right now. As soon as I start talking about it. I start doing it. I always used to say like. All the time. Like like like. like. Um, Whenever I got nervous I'd be. I'd say like. And I also hated my accent on camera. I thought that it didn't sound smart and I thought that it didn't sound nice. I just really didn't like it. Right, okay, so Miss Teen Divine Finals UK. I used to practice and practice for my interview. My voice would sound better and they'd be able to understand me most. And then I remember I went in now for the interview and I met the judges and I was talking to them. And after I won, one of the judges said to me, your voice is so Welshy. You sound how a Welsh person should sound. And I thought to myself, oh my gosh, I should be ashamed of myself. I'm representing Wales in this pageant and I'm putting on an English accent. Keep your accent, don't change it because that's what makes you you and you should love it. You should be proud of where you're from. Fourth insecurity is my eczema. Some of you may not know, some of you may know, but the reason why I have eczema is because when I drink dairy products, it has like a reaction to my skin and it causes my lips to swell a little bit. And I would show you guys, but like I'm not wearing anything underneath this. I have a little bit of eczema like here, here. It's my own fault because I love coffee. I'm obsessed with cappuccinos, lattes, americanos, hot chocolate. I just love it. I'm not willing to cut coffee. Something that I love out of my diet because it gives me eczema, you know? Like, I know how to cope with eczema. I can stick a little bit of eczema. Experimented with, like, different foods and things to see which is the main factors. And they are the ones that I take it easy on. I used to hide, like, my eczema, but now I just, like, embrace it. I used to, like, have a bit on my finger and i put a ring on it just so you, you wouldn't see it, but that would make the eczema 
makes me worse because he'd be irritating it. So now what I do is I just, just leave it. I don't really mind. I just think, you know, it's me. It's a part of me. I've always had eczema. I always probably will have eczema. I just go to cope with it, embrace it, and help to find a cure to it, maybe. Because it is really annoying when you're sat in bed. I'll take it off because it's... Drum roll, please. And by the way, a funny fact about me, my crown didn't fit me, and I was laughing, and I was like, oh, poor on fell. Thank you guys so much for watching, I love you so much, thank you for all the support, it made me feel so much better talking to you guys, and tell me your insecurities, because it does honestly make you feel so much better when it's out in the open. Love you so much, thank you for all the love and support, from your Miss Teen Divine 2017-18.